How you doing? I'm Captain Rob Gordon at St. Pete, Florida. What I'm going to do is show you how to throw a 12-foot cast net. It's one of the most important tools as a fisherman in Florida that you could ever learn. It allows you to go fill the well full of bait. And the more bait you have, the more fish you can catch. You can use it as chum. You, know, you don't have to buy it. The most investment you have is the cast net. A lot of people don't like to do it. It's, it's very strenuous, very hard work, it's very heavy. You get wet but uh, it's one of the most important things. When I started fishing 17 years ago as a guide, it's one of the first things I ever, ever done is learn how to throw a 12 foot cast net. And what, what I did was I sat down, read a book, and it took me about two hours to learn this technique. Didn't have video to watch, so uh, pretty fortunate. Now earlier, when we were pulling up to my first bait spot, you could see the bait on the surface. It looked like it was raining. I call it raining bait. There was a lot of bait there. It was heavy current, heavy wind, so it's pretty, pretty tight space to throw a cast net in around bridge pilings. So I'm out here in the open. For demonstrations purposes, I'm gonna show you how to throw my 12 foot cast net. Now what I like to do is uh, throw the three part method. You use three parts, take one in your left hand, that's a third of the net, and go underneath and over. That's one part. The second part, I'll gather it up with my left hand, that's the second part, and this is critical right here. You, hold, you want to hold the lead line with the first finger and the thumb. Hands no more than six inches apart. That's what's going to allow you to swing the net correctly. Keep them together like a pendulum. And now you got one on the shoulder, one in the left hand, one in the right hand. That's the three-part method. This technique has made my life so much easier. You don't have to put the lead in your teeth like traditional method. It saves your teeth and it saves your back. It's a lot easier to throw this net in the three-part method. All right, here we go, we are ready. Now when you go to swing, you just swing your arms, your hand, keep your hands together, go nice and slow, like a pendulum, and now you're ready to cast. And it'll pancake every time, perfectly. Now as we are pulling up to our fishing spot, another way you can locate bait is you look for birds diving. Pelicans, terns, seagulls, those three birds right there are a great indicator that there's gonna be bait there. If they're diving into water and you see a lot of birds, that's probably white bait. White bait is one of the most sought after baits in, in the West Central Florida area. Now the baits that they're diving in are usually a little bit smaller. So that's why I like to go to the bridge, get the bigger baits at the bridge, smaller baits in the, in the grass flats where the birds are diving. You could take your pick. Now one thing when we were looking for bait, we saw the birds diving, dolphins moved in on us. It was pretty cool. Now dolphins, it's a myth, you know, they're a good indicator that there's fish around, but you don't want them around. They will feed on your fish that you're catching and release. So they moved in on us, they were flipping mullet in the air, feeding aggressively on mullet schools and a redfish release. So if there's dolphins in the area, they can mess up your fishing. The great thing about a 12 foot cast net, you can load your well really fast, get loaded up with a lot of bait and less throws. It's the best investment you'll ever make. 12 foot cast net, fill the well full of bait. I'm Captain Rob Gorda in St. Pete, Florida. Look at this. That's what happens when you throw a 12 foot net. There's so much bait in the net, I can't even lift it. That's how it's done right there. These are scale sardines, candy. And we're done, one and done, it's good. All right. It's like a 30 minute workout in five minutes. That's prime bait. You can't beat a 12 foot cast net. That was sweet.